I'm going to show you how to make peach and ginger no churn ice cream. This is a fabulous recipe to cheat your way to homemade ice cream without any extra fancy kitchen equipment. To start the recipe off, I'm going to peel the peaches and the way to do that is to just pour boiling water over your peaches in a heat proof bowl, just like that. The peaches will sit in the boiling water for 10 minutes and whilst they're doing that, I'm actually going to whip up the double cream. And the reason I'm using double cream is because it gives you a wonderful, rich, fluffy texture. And I'm going to add to it some condensed milk. This actually is also a brilliant way of giving you that silky, sweet flavor that you're going to achieve without churning. There we go. Now, let's give it a whip. So I'm gonna whip it on low, otherwise I will end up spraying it all over myself, which is not really the aim of the game. Now the whisk is starting to feel quite heavy in my hand, which is a good sign that we are there. So I'm gonna stop this, here we go. Now what I'm looking for here are these wonderful thick ribbon trails. That tells me that the cream has really thickened up and is ready for the rest of the ingredients. There we go. Now that the cream is at the perfect texture, Start with crystallized ginger. The important thing here is just to make sure that you roughly chop the ginger, not too fine, so that when you end up with the final ice cream, you will find little chunks of this delicious, chewy ginger that appears within the body of the ice cream. Right, back to our peaches. I'm going to just remove the skins from the peaches, just score it that way and this way, so into four sections. And that will simply help you to get hold of the skin and just peel it off like that. Once you've finished peeling all the peaches, this is my final little strip here, I'm going to chop them up. You could also use plums instead of peaches if you wanted to. Exactly the same method would apply to them. Now, one last rough chop. Perfect, ready to go in to the ice cream mixture. Chopped but not completely disintegrated at all. So in they go and look how beautiful already. Last bit, there we go. This is my favorite part of the recipe. Mixing in together the beautiful creamy swirls of ice cream with the peaches and the ginger chunks. Now I'm doing it quite slowly because I just want to make sure I do have those chunks coming through. Now we're ready to transfer it into this plastic container, which of course is going to go into the freezer. There we go. In it goes, lovely chunks. Little chewy presents within the ice cream mixture. <laughs> Once the ice cream is in the container, just put it in the freezer for three to four hours or ideally overnight. Right, now this obviously is the most exciting part of the recipe. Beautiful ice cream with delicious chunks of peach and ginger. So here we go. Ooh, gosh, that looks amazing, doesn't it? Into the cone. And as you can see, absolutely fantastic chunks. And here you have it. Peach and ginger, no churn ice cream. Absolutely perfect for a summer treat.